Let's start with the tilapia. We have this beautiful fish here, and we're gonna make a sauce and grill the fish basically at the same time. So what we're gonna do is make a, uh, a version of a classic butter sauce known as a beurre blanc in French. And um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some shallots, we're gonna peel our shallots. We're gonna take some shallots, some white wine, some lemon juice and some lemon zest. So first we'll take the zest off. And might as well squeeze some of the juice in there too. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna use our uh, tilapia fillets. And the tilapia is a, uh, you know, it's a, it's a white fish. It's, it's very mild in flavor, but it has a nice density to it. It's a good, dense fish. Now, if you can't find tilapia, we can use something like red snapper or halibut, something along those lines. And we're gonna just uh, rub that with uh, some canola oil and salt and pepper. So we get it on the grill. Season it with salt and pepper. Okay, four minutes on one side, give it a flip. Another four minutes, maybe eight minutes total. Now a flakier fish, such as tilapia or red snapper or halibut, is gonna be a little tougher to grill than say something that's in a steak form, like tuna or swordfish. But the key to this is letting it cook so that it comes away from the grill almost on its own so that you can give it one quick flip, just like that. We're gonna cover this up and we're gonna let this cook, we're gonna sort of keep the heat in there. And then uh, really it should only be about um, maybe a minute and a half longer and then we're gonna take it off because we don't want this fish to overcook or the asparagus. So get our fish off the grill before it overcooks. And that's another thing that uh, you know people say to me all the time that they like to cook fish on the grill but they overcook it. Just take it off a little bit sooner than you think it's gonna take. I mean really gonna cook almost in no time. Okay, now what we started here was some shallots, some lemon zest, and some lemon juice. And now we're gonna add just a touch of heavy cream. Just a touch. This is a really good trick. It's a good way to stabilize a butter sauce so that it doesn't separate. Tricks of the trade. Okay, and now, we're just gonna start adding a whole bunch of unsalted butter. Okay, let's go back over to the fish. Okay, and now we could add a whole bunch of capers in here. And we can actually start to plate the, uh, plate the fish with the sauce. Give it some flavor. 